All right. So I just want to clarify a few more drag and drop features that were added but uh, weren't really mentioned properly before. And one of them is adding uh, movies to the sequencer. So usually you have a lot of movie files and you want to add them to the sequencer. So what you can do now is that you can load up any, any movie file. And I have one here of myself running across a parking lot. And so you can simply add that by just dragging that in. And of course you can add more. Uh, I have a, a different one here. And, uh, and of course you can just add those in and it just works normally. And there you go. So that works. And the other thing you can do is if you're in the image editor, you can add images now uh, by just dragging them over. So here's an image of a guy on a bicycle, different one. I also want to clarify that these things work both for images and movies actually so you can also add a movie here and scrub. Uh, you just need to set the frames, auto refresh and then once you have that you can actually also scrub and see the results in the image editor.